Philip, you want to make a trap for your friends which they cannot escape whatsoever. Well, have I got the perfect trap for you. Now, fortunately, I do not have any friends, but it still works in single player. So, if I fall down here, it just flashes over, and if I try to break out, <clears throat> no matter where I look, nothing works. I'm stuck here forever. With one exception, the only way out is this. And here's how it works. As you can see, it's just pistons firing back and forth, and these cannot be broken for 0.9 seconds. And here's all that you need to build this. So what you want to do is you want to place your honeycomb blocks like this, so you have two for the floor. This is where the person will be standing. Then you want to place two sticky pistons just like this. Two hun four honey blocks like that. And then you want to have two on one side, two on the other, one on the top, and then add one right there with a sticky piston facing into it, like so. Then you want to place your observer right, right up there facing this way into a hole. And then you want to place string in front of the observer. A target block coming out of the observer, and then you want to take a dropper, which I do not have for some reason. And you want to place it right there. Then you want to take a chest and shift click it onto the dropper, place an item into the dropper. It can be any item, pretty much. And that is the detection circuit all in place. Next, you're going to want to place blocks like this. Three outs, then one down, two over, and then two like that. Then you want to place a repeater with three ticks on it, a repeater with one tick, and a comparator. And then you want to take your redstone and place it right there like that. Place a sticky piston facing this way here. Then go to the other side and place another sticky piston. Then you want to place an observer facing this way and an observer facing this way. Now to wire up this piston right here, you want to place your two slabs, then take one redstone, place it up there, and one repeater placing it right up there. And because of butt powering, this will get power. Now finally, you want to place a block here and a block right here. Place a repeater with three ticks going into both those pistons. And then you want to take your observer and place it so it's like that. That should be everything. Now to test it, all I need to do is step into it. Well, I didn't step into it, but as you can see, it's pushing back and forth. And to reset, you just take the item out there and stick it into the dropper again. Then if I fall in for real this time, you can see I'm being pushed out. And in creative mode, it's annoying to get out. So I just patch that up and that's it. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And until next time, Bye.